and welcome to Outdoors and That. Today I've got a Black Diamond Mission 75 litre pack. And so this pack costs about 420 Australian dollars as its recommended retail price. So let's run through some of its features. Now first of all, this is a 75 litre version. It also comes in a 55, 45 and 35 litre sizes. And this is probably on the larger scale of what you'd want to use, especially for using it as a climbing or alpine pack. The 55 and 45 are probably going to be more suitable for most situations. But this one does carry a huge volume of gear and that is a useful thing. But the next part of this is it's a nylon pack and our harness system here is got a thermoform plastic uh, backing so that's what's giving it its shape through there. And if we put this on I'll show you some of the features of the harness. So First thing to look at here is that the hip belt uh, only just makes it around the front of my hip and so if you're a larger person then you're not going to have much coverage on the hip bone there and so that will be a, a little uncomfortable. The width of the shoulder straps wouldn't be a problem if you're wearing multiple layers in an alpine situation but if you're using this in a, a summer situation, rock climbing, then the narrowness of the shoulders is possibly a bit of an issue because it is quite uncomfortable like that. The other thing is that our foam is all closed cell foam so it's not going to absorb any water and gain any extra weight for the pack and that means that the overall pack weight here is 1.8 kilos and that's not going to get heavier if it gets wet in the, uh, in the rain. You can strip it down a little bit so you can remove the waistband uh, if you want. It's a little bit, little bit fiddly but that slides out of the center of here and you can remove the lid as well and cut down on some of the kilos uh, a bit like that so stripping down it if you need it. One of the things which I really like on it are the buckle system and I'll give you a close up on that one. Then the pocket on the front it's designed to carry crampons but it is just a really large universal pocket super useful uh, drains water out the bottom if you're in a, a wet situation there and then there's ice axe holders uh, here but you could also use this for walking poles uh, and clipping on any extra gear that you want on the outside of your pack. The idea here is that in an alpine situation when you're wearing gloves you don't have to get your fingers into the smaller bits there and so just by pressing on the outside they've kind of redesigned this to jump off like that so really easy to undo the buckles. The other thing which I think is missing from a lot of packs and should be uh, a standard feature is how they've designed the draw cords here so if I just pull on this black loop, then that loosens it right up. So that's really easy. And then I can just pull on the blue string to do that. And so they've done that by just stitching the locking mechanism in here. And that makes it really easy for opening things up and, uh, and getting on the inside. And so I can just pull, pull it out and get onto the inside of this pack without any trouble and I'm just doing this one handed so it's because of the zip on the gear loadout feature the drawstring doesn't go all the way around the top and so it's actually just stitched uh, in here and I have pulled too hard on the drawstring before and that's popped the stitching out of here and I had to sew that uh, back into place so this pack has a gear loadout feature and if we pop our side buckles what I can do is unzip the whole side of the pack and then it's really easy to empty out whatever gear you have on the inside uh, of this like that on the ground and then you can zip it uh, back up nice and easily. The next thing is that it's a two-way zip so you can get in from both sides uh, of that and you can see here how tall this gusset is at the top so heaps of room for carrying any extra loads if you needed it. Looking at our lid we have a pocket on the inside and a pocket on the outside and this one zips all the way around to over there so it gives you really good access to the top of the pack. Overall there. I really like this pack as a climbing and an alpine pack. It's definitely not a hiking pack and it's not been designed for that so I think asking it to go hiking is, uh, is not, not fair on it. So overall really good love the buckles love the drawstring systems uh, the gear loadout feature you know it's okay but you know not essential and so 
overall, this is our Black Diamond Mission 75 litre pack. Thanks for watching Outdoors and that.